Where's my iPhone, dog? Matter of fact, where's my iPhone, dog? Where's my iPhone, dog? Matter of fact, where's my iPhone, dog? I stick to YouTube. It's like TV. Yo, look at the size of that truck. Yo, look, look at the tires on that truck. Look at that. You don't want no problems with the SWAT team, man. They'll put you in a casket. They'll put you in that casket. You'll die. Don't mess with the SWAT. Authentic Filipino food, and I'm quite happy. You like this? Thumbs up. Mm. <laughs> good, good, good. We got invited to a beautiful restaurant eating some uh, authentic Filipino cuisine. I'm very happy. Very, very happy. This is great food. Look at this. Mmm. Mm. We ended up drinking. Do you agree? Yeah. Too much. Too much. We drank too much liquor. So, this is the effects of drinking liquor. We drank this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not even. Maybe later I'll feel it. That's why I don't feel this. You don't feel it? No. He reminds me of DJ. Doesn't he remind me of you? <laughs> Look at all this food, my God! You can't, you can't have a half without bourbon. Or if that's the over, we gotta have bourbon. Look at that food. Mmm, it's good. I mean, even Nyla enjoyed it. Right, my mom? The kids are playing. The kids are playing. The grown-ups are happy. I'm happy. I'm wearing my new Yeezys. You could only wear these, I think, with khakis. But either way, you're not only with khakis, but then probably look best with khakis. And now let's happy. Hello, sir. How art thou? What was that? <laughs> Hi, Colin. The Wiggly at your service. Am I gonna be in your next video? Might as well be. Might as well be in my next one. You saw that little dance she did? I murked the kava. She's still eating the kava. No, what kind of food is that? It's lentils. Would you guys eat this? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Here. Ugh, this looks like Swap. She suggested I do scent bird for men. What do you guys think? Listen, I don't wear cologne. The cologne I'm wear is the stuff that you can't you it's hard to buy. I, I buy I don't buy um toilet. I buy perfume for men. Some call it cologne. But when you go to the certain store they call it perfume. What's a cologne that you like? I don't even know the name of the cologne I like. That's how much you like Armani cologne. What do you wear? I don't, the name of it, I don't even, Labad, Lablabo. The ones that I, I buy are the families of fragrances. I like to buy directly from the actual families that have the farms for the, fra for the fragrance. My shoes have dirt on them because it was raining. Well, my shoes don't do that. Eyes in the business, 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 eyes in the eyes in the eyes in the business. We hit in the business, in the business, 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 business. Nike, you you didn't do it. I'm returning those Nikes. I did a review on about a month ago, and uh, I'm a little upset about it because I expected a lot more from these shoes, and. I'm not saying it let me down, but it took about 50 miles of walking just to break them in. No biggie. And they are comfortable, but there's something just not right with them. Like, for instance, they cracked. Like, right in the front forefoot on the right-hand side, it cracked. From what? From wear and tear? 
and these shoes are two hundred dollars and I need a new pair of beaters but I'm fully getting a refund from Nike with these Zoom X shoes I mean the, the, the idea was cool the intent was okay but the execution I feel like and it looks like a super dad shoe it doesn't even look pretty and I wear a size 13 they look boofy and on top of it it's like there's no room in my toe boxes it took about like a good till they started breaking in for my shoes to actually be comfortable on me just not an overall pleasant experience when you walk it has this big like sound of like a big footprint like sasquatch and a shoe is just big it's, it's like balenciaga shoe type big and it's supposed to be a performance shoe and i tried to do a run around the block with it and it just felt weird like it tried to push you forward and nike you didn't quite i i get it for the for the preservation of the shoe you you put a lot of zoom x in it and you know you don't want it to be unstable so it was wide on the sides and but that that extra zoom x in the back type thing and i'm sure you did a lot of marketing research on it but that just was like nah it just didn't do it for me so i get my 200 dollars back i'm in nike i'm in nike here they go they're getting returned. They're getting returned. I know everyone's like, yo, why are you returning them? I'm returning them because I don't like them. These don't do the job. Could you see this? What the? Going back. Am I the first person you see re return these? Really? Am I the first person to return these? Really? Do people love these shoes? I'm starting to second guess myself now. They said every nobody has returned these things. The only one to return them that they've seen. Well, besides that, I don't know what this is. This little thing right here. But besides that, it's just I wear I wear 13. <clears throat> sorry, I wear 13. My toe just don't feel right in it. In the front, the big toe. Second, I try to run in them. It forces you to like kind of like like right here, you run right here, and the right here doesn't have as much cushion. So it's a strange sensation for me because I'm like a midfoot runner and I need like some sort, I need like, sometimes I need to run on my back, sometimes I need to run in the middle, sometimes I need to run on the tippy toes. This doesn't offer me what I need, right, the range. It just puts me in one place. And I've been using it for walking primarily. No bueno. All right, you too. Oh, they were good sports about it. Oh, that's so nice. All right, y'all. I was the first person they said to ever return those. It is what it is. I'm never going to buy those again. I would, though, buy another iteration of it, but just not those. Uh, do I feel bad? Absolutely not. Look what I got on my feet. I'm a Nike guy. I'm a Nike guy. I stick to YouTube. It's like TV.